Hi guys, this is Education Trick 99. So today we will learn how to solve integration in a trickiest manner. So let's start. So first of all, you should know this trick. Then you have to solve some question on the basis of this trick. So let's start. So integration of a cos x plus b sin x upon c cos x plus d sin x. So first of all, you have to multiply a multiply c and plus b multiply d divided by c square plus d square. And then you have to write plus and then you have to take cross multiplication like a multiply d of minus of b multiply c divide by c square plus d square here a b c d are the coefficients no down and then you have to multiply with log of mod of denominator plus c so one note more denominator is c cos x plus t sin x so you have to write in this area okay so you should know this trick then you solve the questions based on that trick okay so please note down this trick on your notebook so this is very important trick for uh, competitive exams because we have not enough time for solving questions so this trick is very important for like iit je exams or another entrance exams so let's start the question the i is equal to integration of 3 cos x plus 4 sin x upon 2 cos x plus 3 sin x. So friends, you should be always right in this form like cos x plus sin x cos x plus sin x. Our question is already in this form. So we don't manipulate this. So 3 cos x plus sin x upon 2 cos x plus 3 sin x. Okay. So here a is equal to 3, b is equal to 4, c is equal to 2 and d is equal to 3. Don't write in your answer sheet like in class 12th or class 11 students, especially for class 11th or class 12th students. Uh, don't don't write because teacher will not give you for this uh, for that big, uh, number because this is only for understanding so please don't write it is only for understanding okay so yes a is equal to 3 b is equal to 4 c is equal to 2 and d is equal to 3 so let's start like a into c so uh, 3 multiplied 2 plus Okay, A into C like B into D, 4 into 3 divided by C square means 2 ka square plus 3 square, 3 ka whole square. Okay, so 3 is whole square. Now you have to take plus sign in this and now A multiply B minus A multiply B minus C or oh sorry, A multiply C. You have to take cross multiplication. So 3 into 3 minus 4 into 2 divide by 2 ka square plus 3 whole square okay now multiply log of denominator that means 2 of cos x plus 3 of sin x plus c so further solving 3 to the 6 plus 4 into 3 12 2 ka square 4 3 whole square 9 then 3 3 is a 9 minus 8 4 plus 9 log 2 cos x plus 3 sin x plus c so 12 plus 6 is 18 9 plus 4 is 13 plus 1 upon 13 then log 2 cos x plus 3 sin x plus c. So this will be your answer. Okay. So this is a very tricky question. So please note this trick because it is very important for entrance exams point of view. Now uh, let us the, take second example for further understanding. Yes, 
like integration of 1 upon 1 plus tan x. Okay, now you little bit confused in that question because this is not in the form of previous question. But you have to make them in previous question forms like we know tan x is equal to sin x divided by cos x. Okay, so i is equal to integration 1 plus sin x upon cos x. Okay, so now you have to take LCM of this. So integration 1 upon cos x plus sin x divided by cos x dx. So this cos x will go up to the numerator and this cos 6 upon cos x plus sin x. Okay, so we write 0 sin x for our better understanding. So 0 sin x. Okay, now this is in the form which we taught earlier. Okay, so a is equal to here 1 b is equal to 0, c is equal to 1 and d is equal to 1. Okay, now you have to apply same trick like a multiply b that a multiply c that means 1 multiply 1 plus b multiply d that means this 1 ka square plus 1 whole square. Okay, now plus cross multiplication 1 multiply 1 minus 0 multiply 1, 1 square plus 1 square log cos x plus sin x. Okay, so when you solve further, this is your answer. So please try to understand this trick. This trick is very, very important. So thank you for watching this trick. If you like, please subscribe.